Welcome, my friends. <laughs> I didn't. I don't know if I'm gonna actually do this video. I don't know how my day is gonna go. Pouring rain. Hallelujah. No more smoke smell. No more smoke in the air. We did school at home with the kids. Realized Chelsea has four homework assignments that are undone. But she's off playing with friends for one more hour. And then she has to come home and do her homework. Ashley is all caught up with her homework for the first time since school started. She started a brand new day with no homework. And she's really happy that she has nothing left today to do. It's Wednesday. They have half day. The teachers didn't give any extra assignments, so it should be easy for Chelsea get, to get caught up. But also, it's curriculum night tonight for their elementary school. Unfortunately, the women at church are supposed to have an activity tonight, a drive-by, get a treat from the presidency. They didn't know that it was also the school's curriculum night, which we always try to avoid a school function and a church function on the same night. They didn't realize that. <laughs> I had to point it out. I was like, um, how am I supposed to do both? So Jason's gonna come home from work. I'll do the first uh, Zoom call for Chelsea's class. We'll bypass the one for the principal who needs to hear the, from the principal, except when she's the middle school principal and your best friend. And then I will join the Zoom call for Ashley's class from the car and Jason will do it from home as he finagles the kids at bedtime. So we'll just kinda do what we can. But I have been sitting in the parking lot at Costco by myself with a drink and enjoying my time alone, hearing the rain, patter on my car. I don't have to answer to a kid not getting on their Zoom call. Chelsea got dropped from her call like 20 times a day. Just been enjoying my time. I'm going to Costco with a few things on my list, but I kinda wanna wander because I'm by myself and I don't need a ton of groceries. The girls want like one extra fun snack for like taking to their friend's house when they go for lunch time. They always kind of like have little lunch picnics and now it's gonna be in garages when the rain is here. I might try to find a little fun snack for them to take and then I just wanna wander. It's been a long time since I wandered. I guess Jason and I have been doing a little bit just because our grocery shopping has become different during this whole quarantine period, but it'll be fun. I don't know. We'll see what I get. It won't be a big haul by any means. We'll just go have fun and then see how our day goes. I don't know. The kids are all gone, so I don't have any kids to film anymore, and I am done editing a video, so this is just me. This is just my life now. <laughs> it's just, it's what it is. I literally came for three things. <laughs> Clearly I'm doing well. Okay, how many people have been here for a year and know the problem we have now? How much do you think Jason's gonna spend this year? All right, we are gonna show what I got. Nothing super fantastic. And no, I did not go to Costco hungry. We just needed Coke. And like I said, someone is going to be very happy about this. And we had a fight last night, so this is a good um, apology. <laughs> Let's just say that. And then I got, my kids are right behind me with their friend. So I got them some Go-Gurt and we got our breakfast drinks. I got a bag of chips. I got their his and hers. <laughs> S'mores. I got one for each of us. Oh, I also got some Baby Bell cheese. So the Baby Bells were on rebate. Normally they're like $12, and they were on rebate for seven, which is an incredible rebate. So I got those for Abby. So then the Nuggets were on rebate as well, so I got those. And then I got three bags of the Pirate Booty and one bag of the Annie's um, Extra Cheesy, Cheesier Than Ever Fake Cheetos, <laughs> whatever you want to call those. And then um, just bread 
And then this is a little bit of an extra. We normally don't do this, but it was on rebate for $8.99 or something like that. I forget. So really good deal on that one. Easy for them to take and they don't have to take Tupperwares to pack up their chips to take out. So, so anyway, that's it. Nothing super fancy. Um, but I did find some good deals. Okay, so this is what the girls are doing, and I can't show this girl's face. Here, so I'm cover showing her blanket. <laughs> yeah, cover her there. head. But these are girls are soaking wet. Face. Did you jump on the? <laughs> yeah. Did you jump on the trampoline when it was pouring rain? Yeah. So now you're soaking wet. No, it actually dried off. I changed. But your hair is all wet. You're still. Yeah, she's still wet. Well, yeah. I mean, we gave. Does she want to change some clothes? We have your, her size. Oh yeah, we do. Yeah. yeah. She can change if she wants to. All right, I'm cheating for dinner. I'm going the easy route. I have green beans and chicken nuggets. Then the kids can have fruit, bananas. I think the strawberries are gone, or oranges. But I have to do log into curriculum night in like 20 minutes, 30 minutes. And I'm still editing my thumbnail <laughs> for tomorrow's video. I'm like so behind you guys. So I'm waiting for Jason to get home and they can have a simple dinner. And then I have to head off to, to do a drive by get together. It could last five minutes and I'll be back home or we could all stop our cars and chat. I don't know. I think it's still raining, so I don't know how we would get out and like socially distance hang out, but and we can't go in the church building because that's against the rules for a group of more than, I don't even know what the numbers are at. I don't know why people use towels like this for more than just drying your hands. I can't stand this. Like, and the girls have made a mess out here. Not mess. I'm proud that they are trying to be creative in what they're doing. But, you know, <laughs> I don't know where they went either. This is their friend's bike. So, I don't know. They've got to come home and pick that up. They're being creative and they're having fun. But they've just got to clean up that mess. And I've got a cute little love note on Jason's bag of s'mores put it here in his little area I'm waiting for the oven to preheat i'm gonna go and edit that thumbnail and maybe jason and i will be back to chat oh, let's turn this fan off it's getting a little cold i came home from costco and i was so hot i don't wear raincoats here even though it seems silly to not wear a raincoat i get so hot so i was wearing a sweatshirt like you saw and I came home and I had like beads of sweat and <laughs> just, I get hot shopping and going in and out of stores and now you add the mask and I have shorts on you guys. I have shorts on and I wore a t-shirt and then a sweatshirt and I came home and I was like dying of heat. So I just have to live in layers so I can unload layer at a time. But here, let me show you my little process of doing pictures. This is the fifth attempt at <laughs> my thumbnail picture that you guys see and want to click on. So here's attempt number four. I have to just make it, you know, catching to the eye and make you want to click on it. I haven't even added the title to it, so I got to do that still. And then you can see my, and then you can see my little n notices right here covering up the name of the school. <laughs> but I've got my notices and I'm going to snooze both of those so that I am not late to either one of those events. All right, I forgot to film the ending today's video with makeup on, so you'll have to bear with me. I am home way later than I thought I was going to be, and since we technically didn't make dinner, <laughs> I'm having mac and cheese, which I rarely have, and peas. I've got my vegetable, but this is the only reason why I'm having Annie's mac and cheese. It's probably the best mac and cheese that you can eat in terms of like taste, but the, this is from my neighbor. Let me show you what else she brought over. Okay, check it out. My friend, my neighbor across the street is moving and she doesn't want to move any of this. So I've got all these canned goods. I've got lasagna noodles. I've got a whole Tupperware of animal cookies and Kodiak 
pancake mix, pretzels, and then she gave two boxes of the Annie's mac and cheese. There's another one right here, the white cheddar. I just chose this one. So that's what I'm making there. And then a bag of chips, two jars of jelly, a package of orzo pasta, a can of um, applesauce, and then in here she brought this little Goya, I don't even know what it is. I don't know if that's good, we'll find out. And then she brought this cherry, mar mar what, how do you say it, maraschino cherries. My kids are gonna love this. This <laughs> giant garlic bottle is from my father-in-law. He's like, oh, I need garlic. So he grabbed it when he was at Costco, and then he realized how big it was when he got home. <laughs> so he took some in a tiny, tiny jar and gave this to me. I have already filled up my little jar that I normally have it in. It was almost gone, so I just filled that one up. So now I need to donate this to other people. So that's kind of nice. Also, this is what you have when you have a 13-year-old who likes to bake. I constantly have baked goods right under my nose all day, every day. And it's so hard to not want to eat that right now. But I'm gonna resist. So Jason's upstairs um, with the girls, trying to convince him to go to sleep. But I went to, well I went to, I listened to the curriculum night here at home for one of the kids. Battery's flashing, I gotta hurry. Then I did the other one in the car, went to my church activity, and I got this cute loaf of bread with a little tea towel. Isn't that cute? Oh, how we need each other is what it says on the card and then a little message. And it was fun to, to see everyone in our cars and we eventually got out of our cars and it stopped raining, had masks on, socially distanced, just chatted in the rain, in the dark, and it was nice. And then I delivered bread to two other friends that weren't able to go and came home and now I'm done for the day. It's nine o'clock. But that's gonna be it today. I did Costco and I did this tonight. It doesn't feel like I did anything today, but it's mind blowing how quick the day goes and how much you actually can get done in one day. So I'm gonna end that here tonight and wish you guys the best. I love all the new people that are following and commenting and joining us here, so we appreciate that and we will see you guys next time. Jason has to do his video of embarrassing moments. So stick around, hit that subscribe button so that you can find out what his most embarrassing moments are. If you haven't watched mine, go check out the video. I'll leave it here and down below. So take care you guys, bye.